battery's dead already. What? What the what? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> You're cold. It's a chilly day. <laughs> so the other day, Ben and I took a look back at the movies we saw in the theaters last year in 2017. So we thought in this vlog, we would take a look at movies that were coming out in 2018. So we have a list of release dates on the phone. I think we'll start in February. That's where it starts. Okay, it actually starts in January, but we're, we're midway through January. And okay. January is like a slow month for movies. So we're not going to read off every single one, just like... We're gonna skim through and look for highlights. Yeah, I just looked at January and I don't see anything that we... Well, there's okay. pa Paddington too. Somebody brought that up in uh, our live stream the other day. Yeah, and um, like we said in our live stream... We haven't even seen Paddington 1, but it's on. I noticed it's on Netflix I now. didn't even know there was a Paddington <laughs> 1. <laughs> okay, so starting in February. There's a movie called Winchester. It's not about Supernatural. It's Why? Not, it's about that house. Do you remember the... Have you ever heard the story of the Winchester house? No, that, but it should be about Supernatural, <laughs> personally. I wouldn't be surprised if the Supernatural boys were named after this house. Oh, like, it could be. Like, way back in the olden days, there was this widow who went to a psychic and said, like, something to the effect of, like, you won't be haunted as long as this house is continuously built. So there's like weird staircases. I think oh, maybe yeah. Adam the Woo went there. I don't know. Or Justin Scarter, one of the vloggers we watch. Doesn't it ring a bell? Yes, it does. Where there's like little tiny staircases that go nowhere because this woman believed that something bad would happen to her if these construction workers didn't keep building this house 24 hours a day, nonstop. Did the construction workers pay the psychic to say that? Because I feel like that would be, <laughs> you know, that would be a pretty good scam. Okay. So, that sounds interesting. I might want to see that see. when it comes out on DVD. Well, I guess we're making a Peter Rabbit movie. That's okay, coming stop, out. stop oh, reading sorry. faster than me. Oh, sorry. Okay, all right. So, I don't know what that is. Yeah, we're just gonna, we're, we're just gonna pick out the, the but, highlights. Yeah, Peter Rabbit. That sounds... Oh, I've seen commercials for that, yeah. It's kind of like Hop type. Yeah, the like animation. yeah, like CGI. It looks yeah. like a real rabbit. Yeah, it looks like running well, my name. Yeah, and we're all remember we're also parents of a three year old, so <laughs> probably most of the movies we'll be seeing in the theater in 2018 will probably be like uh, Peter Rabbit. <laughs> uh. Okay, here's one though, February 16th, Black Panther. These Marvel movies are getting earlier and earlier oh, every oh, year. I like it. Like summer movie season <laughs> starting in February. <laughs> I don't know what any of these other ones are. It's okay. Just uh, we'll just get to and the highlights. So in March we have. Mm. Well, there's that Wrinkle in Time yeah, Disney Rin movie with yeah, Oprah. Yeah, that... we saw the trailer in front I'm of. I'm confused. What, what Star Wars? We saw it in front of. Yes, it sounds interesting, but I I'm confused. Yeah, I have no <laughs> idea what's going on. We never read the book, obviously. No. Okay. Um, don't mind me nosing it. I'm, they're making another Tomb Raider movie, oh, apparently. Oh, nice. I liked the Tomb Raider movies. Um, mm -hmm. <laughs> what's Sherlock Gnomes? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> if you know what Sherlock Gnomes is, is it, is it about a gnome? I would. Maybe it's a Sherlock cry? gnome. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if that's what it is. Oh, Look, let me click on it. All right. Hopefully it doesn't. Uh, okay. Uh, oh, it's a, it's a, um... No, no, wait. Oh yeah, it is an, it's it's, an animated yeah. movie with garden gnomes. Yeah, apparently. Sherlock and gnomes. Interesting. Okay. And apparently Johnny Depp is doing a voice in it. Okay, so, interesting. Um, Isle of Dogs, I don't know what that is. Um, Pacific no, oh, Rim yeah, they're, Uprising. They're doing another Pacific Rim. That was, I liked that. I, we only saw it once. So I, I think we got it on like a Black Friday Blu-ray. Yeah, I think um, I wanna I wanna see that. We probably won't see it in the theater, but I don't remember if we were talking about it in a vlog or if we were just talking about it on a car trip. But Steven Spielberg's uh, Ready Player One coming out on March oh, yeah, 30th. Yeah, yeah. That's the one that's like like the, like in the future, the real world is such a horrible place that everybody plays this video game, which is like a mashup of like everything. Mm -hmm. So there's like references to like, I, I don't remember them all now, but we were reading through it. Yeah. It was like, I remember Iron Giant and Back to the a Future lot. and <laughs> Friday the 13th. And, so that'll be an interesting yeah. one to see. Uh, right. 
on to April. Whether or not we actually see all of these in the theaters or get them on Blu-ray on Black Friday uh, or see them on Netflix remains to be seen. Right. So we are into April. April already. New Mutants. I don't know what that is. Oh, is that the new X-Men movie? I think so. I think so. I think there are a couple X-Men movies coming. I don't know what New Mutants is, but that sounds intriguing. Rampage on April 20th. That's based on an old 80s video game, and it stars uh, Dwayne The Rock Johnson. How come I haven't seen him, like, tweeting about it? Well, he has to get... I know, he's, all, he he's get, currently on Jumanji. Yeah, it's like but, he has to get all the Jumanji promotion out of the yeah. way. But I remember, like, the video game involved, like, a giant lizard who was not Godzilla and a giant ape who was not King Kong. Uh -huh. And I don't know, I have very vague recollections of the arcade game, but that's where it gets its name and inspiration from. And it has the rock in it. Well, then I will want to see it. Um, Super Troopers 2. That's a, that's a Ryan movie. Yeah. Ryan and Jenna would go see that yeah, one. Yeah, they would. Uh, let's see. An untitled Cloverfield movie. Previously titled... The God the Particle. The God Particle. Now it do, no longer has a name, so they'll change <laughs> that later, I guess. Right. They better get to moving, though. It's getting released in <laughs> April. They might want to come up with a title. All right, May 4th, May here we 4th! go. Avengers what? Infinity War. Nice. And then, there's nothing. Friday, May 11th, for my birthday, there's not one movie. No, everyone's still going to be seeing Avengers and until May 25th when Solo, Solo. a Star Wars story comes out. Yeah. That's coming out at the end of May. So if Toys R Us is going to do a midnight opening for the toys, it's going to have to be here pretty soon. Yeah. I don't know. That Maybe after Rogue One, it's like, eh, these off, off episode Star Wars movies. Yeah, we'll just put out the stuff whenever. Mm -hmm. Okay, now we're in June. And let's see. Ocean's 8. We're a few oceans behind. I thought that they were done <laughs> with the ocean anyway. But more importantly, on June fifteenth, The Incredibles two. So we'll take that one. Will definitely go take Tegan too. Yeah, because for one, he loves the first Incredibles. Yeah, there was a there was a stretch where he wanted to watch it like every single day. Then we had to take it away because he's getting <laughs> a little too like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's so, gotten a lot better since then. Yeah. Anyway, and then June 22nd, Jurassic World 2, two the Fallen, Fallen Kingdom. Kingdom. We saw a trailer for that in front of Star Wars, and Jeff Goldblum comes back. I know! Spoiler alert, it was in the trailer. So it was in the trailer. If it's in the trailer, it's fair game. We can right. talk about it. I'm super excited. Okay, so now are we in July already? We are into July now. And, oh, on July 6th. Ant-Man and the Wasp. We're going to be at that movie theater like every week. So that's three Marvel movies so far. It's insane. In the same year. Oh, and then there's um, the third Hotel Transylvania. Summer Vacation. They, get, a, they go on a cruise. Yes, and they, they basically rent out the whole cruise ship <laughs> from what I could see from the trailer. So that's interesting. I don't know if that'll be a theater movie or a Netflix movie. We'll, we'll see. We'll see when the summer gets here. We'll see if Tegan wants to go see a movie. And yeah. That's the only if, it's like, if it's like 100 degrees outside, <laughs> it's like, let's go see a movie. Um, Mission, Mission Impossible 6? <laughs> Weird. I, I, I don't think I've seen any Mission Impossible since any like the second one. I haven't seen any. And also Teen Titans Go. To the movies. <laughs> based on the Cartoon Network Teen Titans show, obviously. All right, now we are into August. The Predator. Oh, I guess we're rebooting, we're rebooting the, it again I for like so. the third time. I guess so. And the untitled Christopher Robin project. Is that the Disney movie that we... I think so. Isn't that the Winnie the Pooh movie I that think um, Jim Cummings went to go... At? I didn't know it was coming out so soon. Me Maybe either. it's a different Christopher Robin movie. I don't know. Because apparently like Christopher Robin's all grown up and jaded. and yeah. It's like Hook, except without Winnie the Pooh, with Winnie the Pooh. Uh -huh. You know what I'm trying to say? Right. You know when Peter Pan grew up and hooked? Yeah. And he didn't believe in that stuff mm -hmm. anymore? Just cross out all Peter Pan stuff and write Christopher Robin and Winnie the Pooh. Okay. And Pooh Bear comes back. I don't know. This is all, all the vague things that I've heard. Interesting. The Barbie movie. The Barbie movie <laughs> on August 8th. Is that going to be an animated thing? I don't know. I'm not going to click on it because it doesn't tell me anything anyway. Okay. Um, A whole bunch of stuff we haven't heard about. Nope. Excuse me. Okay, we're into Ooh. September already. September. Oh, they're doing another Robin, Robin Hood. Hood. 
Interesting. A long time ago, you took me to see some Robin Hood movie, and I was bored out of my mind. <laughs> yeah, it was the one with, um... Who was in that one? Oh, it was, uh, the Gladiator guy. Uh, Russell Crowe? Yes, thank you. I, that was so boring. He did not I like it at all. Up. I think I may have fallen asleep. <laughs> No. Okay, oh, I guess not much in September. No. October. October, what do we got? A Venom. A Venom movie. I wonder if that, is that Venom as in? Spider-Man Venom? Or is that something totally different? It could be like a horror movie about <laughs> snakes. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, let's see. What else we got? Goosebumps, Goosebumps. 2. Mm, oh, the. Halloween. Yeah, the rebooted. Or it's not, I guess, I guess not really a reboot. But this is the one that's going to have oh, it's Jamie basically Lee Curtis gonna, like, coming back. It's basically, it, what happens is it goes from the first Halloween movie and then erases everything, everything after out. that. I think so. Either and that, then it comes back either to that or, today. Either that or it's like the first and the second one are canon and then... The rest are just her imagination, apparently. Who knows? We don't know. We don't know. We don't know. Anyway. Okay. Then so we're now. to November. X-Men. Dark, Dark Phoenix. Phoenix. Ooh, I want to see that. And then Mulan. And the live action Mulan comes yeah. out. Um, Dr. Seuss's The, the Grinch. Grinch. They're doing an animated version of The Grinch. No, I think that's already been done. Well, they're doing a computer <laughs> animated full length feature movie of The Grinch okay. where The Grinch is voiced by Benedict Cumberbatch. I might. Did I say his name right? I think I will prefer that one. Over the live action one. The though. Jim Carrey one. Which we have been, we have watched a couple times. Yeah, we watched a couple times over the holiday season. Tegan enjoyed it. And, and it I, I as, have to admit, yeah. it wasn't as bad as, I hadn't seen it since I saw it, you know, 20 some odd years ago. Yeah. You know, you, I appreciated Jim Carrey having a good time. Mm -hmm. And some of his little asides were the funniest <laughs> part of the movie. <laughs> I have to admit, I did chuckle a couple times. It wasn't as bad as I thought. It's still not my favorite. There's still a lot of surprisingly dirty jokes in it for Dr. Seuss. Mm -hmm. But overall, overall, it was okay. Anyway, moving on. Moving on. What else happens in November? Holmes and Watson. Is that going to be another one with uh, Robert Downey Jr.? Or are they like rebooting Dr. <sighs> Holmes now? I don't know. Sherlock Holmes, I mean. First he's a gnome, and then he's a... Uh, I know Sherlock Holmes has a big. Oh, it's oh, Will no, Ferrell, Will and, Ferrell John and John C. C. Riley. C. Riley. So okay. that's another movie Jenna and Ryan yeah. would enjoy. Yeah, probably <laughs> not one for us too much. Um, Fantastic Beasts. We never saw the first Fantastic no, Beasts. No, we need to though. We're so far behind. <laughs> and then, and then, November twenty-first. Ralph breaks the internet. Wreck It Ralph too. Can't wait for that one. That's gonna be so funny. Wreck It Ralph is another Tegan favorite, so he's yes. he's gonna love going to see The Incredibles and Wreck It Ralph too. So mm -hmm. mark the calendar. Right, now yeah. we're in December already. Spider Man Into the Spider Verse. So that... I'm gonna guess the Venom movie was not a Spider Man movie. I don't know. We'll have to. I'll have to you look think that up. Have we're, two we're so... in one year. I don't know, but the Spider Man one. This isn't. Uh, Part of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. This is going to be an animated movie uh, where it's about Miles Morales. It's animated. Oh. It's going to be like CGI. Oh. So okay. that might be interesting. Interesting. So on December 21st, there are two movies that sound interesting. I don't know if we'll see either one. We're so far behind on the DC movies. We haven't seen Wonder Woman, yeah. Batman vs. Superman, Justice League. But Aquaman comes out on December 21st. And Bumblebee. I guess he's gonna star in his own movie. Well, he should be. He's like the best Transformer out there. And wrapping up the year is one that I think could be interesting. Mary Poppins returns. Mm. Was my my accent it as good was as Dick, was it as good as Dick Van Dyke? Well, go Mary Poppins. <laughs> So that should be yeah, that, that should wraps be up the year too, and that is it. The the, the year is Who, over. Who's Mary Poppins again? Was it Emily Emily Blunt? I think so. I'll Google it real quick. Yeah, who's Mary? Really? Who's Mary Poppins? I think Dick Van Dyke makes a cameo, that but Julie sense. Andrews gave her uh, blessing, but did like turn down appearing in it because she didn't want to take the spotlight away from uh, the new Mary Poppins. Well, that was very very nice of her, um, Mary. 
Poppins. Mary Poppins, 2018. Not Poppins, Poppins. <laughs> Chim Chimmery. Chim Chimmery, Chim Chimmery, Chim Chim Chimmery. Now, if I get it wrong, you'll edit edit it out so I get it right. All right, we have Emily Blunt. That's what I said, right? That's Mary Poppins. Meryl Streep. As Topsy. And then we have... Oh, I guess Angela Lansbury is going to be in it. As a balloon lady. Feed the balloons. <laughs> Toppins. I don't know. Uh, and then Dick Van Dyke is Mr. Dawes Jr. Now, which Mr. Makes Mr. Sense. Dawes was the elderly bank president in the right. first movie where Dick Van, Dyke, Dick Van Dyke <laughs> gets under a lot of old old man makeup. Yes. So He's I, keeping it in the family. That's it would be funny if in this one he's like done up like he's like really young. That would be really funny. <laughs> but I think that uh, that probably would be kind of hard. Well, I don't know. They you, they have computers now. You remember when they made like like 20-year-old Robert Downey Jr. in that... Civil War movie. That's true. Okay. So, yeah. And then there's Michael Banks and Jane Banks return. And we have Admiral Boom and Mr. Binnacle and Annabelle Blake Banks must be. New, yeah, it's about, it's ones. about Mary Poppins coming back um, and having an adventure with Jane and Michael's children. Uh-huh. Is, is it the original uh, kids coming back? Or? I don't know. I don't... I don't know. We have Michael Ben? Hank. No, he looks a little too yeah. young to be the kid yeah. from the original. Well, there you go. There's our sneak peek at 2018's movies. What movies are you guys looking forward to see? Let us know down in the comments if we missed any with our rapid scrolling. <laughs> be sure to let us know, there too. Were no, there were no movie posters next to it. It was no. all text. So yeah. we don't really know. Yeah, so we were kind of just looking for names we recognize. Yeah. All right, so there was our 2018 movie preview. It's going to be a big year for movies. Yeah, Starting in a couple weeks with Black Panther. We'll see if we get to see Mr. Panther in the theater. <laughs> Do you think we can call him Mr. Panther? <laughs> I, don't, I don't think that's how it goes. <laughs> we'll see you next time, everybody. Bye. That's all for today. Oh, man.